WFNN. Headline News Update. Good morning, folks. This is Steve Rhodes coming to you live from the shores of sunny Delray Beach, Florida. This is your 11 a.m. update and a slightly mixed bag out there. That mix is coming from the Dow, which is down 67 points. Otherwise, all the other U.S. indices are trading to the upside. S&P up 1.5%. That's about 59 points. 3% plus for the NDX 100, 384 points. The upside, 2% for the Russell. That's 39 points there. Semis up a little over 1%, 35 points for it. You've got gold trading out at 1940. Silver's out, trading out at 23.95. Lights we crude, 76.14, back a quarter. Natural gas is up six pennies, and the 30-year Treasury printed out 132.11. That's up 22 ticks. Let's go try to figure out what all that means. Jelly Bean, we'll take a look at that ES mini in the upper left-hand corner. We'll see that price has attained the one-to-one -one and is approaching the one-to-1.272. -one a to B equals CD, price projection level 42.15. Now, because of that A to B equals CD pattern, if there is a bearish reversal candle that forms, that would generate a sell the D point pattern. You've got that spot volatilix well below its 50-day exponential moving average, spot fix. Trading at 17.57, the 50 days at 21.08. That puts the wind at the back of the sales for the S&P 500. The NQ, gigantic moves over here. It is now targeting the 1.618 A to B equals CD price projection level. That's up at the 12.591 level. Now, today inside the NQ is going to complete a TD nine count top. So whatever today's high is, if price closes above that high tomorrow, that'll tell us about a very strong momentum move to the upside. If you look at the US dollar index, it's trading just slightly higher today, but still finding resistance at the bottom of that daily profile. That's at 101.40. Goldilocks still has a TD9 count top, but price is just consolidating with inside its profile. And that ranged from 1930.80 up to 1961.40. Silver still has its road momentum indicator top, price consolidating within its profile levels of 23.47 to 24.40. Lightspeed crude closed yesterday below the bottom of its daily profile. It is trading below that today. I believe there's a TD nine count pattern that could form between tomorrow and Tuesday, if I'm not mistaken. As far as where price might target, it could be the bottom of that weekly profile at 72.49. Natural gas, you can't touch it. Well, you can do whatever you want, but it doesn't have a technical bottom pattern out there. What it needs now is a bullish reversal candle to confirm its next buy the D point pattern. The 30 year treasury trying to take on resistance. That's at 132 and a half. The price could close above 132.15. Well, that could set up an A to B equals CD to the upside. Steve Rhodes with TFNN. Folks, stay tuned for the Trader's Ed show. But if you are off to start your Thursday, please have a terrific one. And we'll look forward to speaking with you again soon. Take care now.